Hello everybody, Brad Pointer here with another reaction to a song that I haven't heard before. Now this is a band that I haven't heard before. This is October Ends in a song called Playtime. And this was uh, suggested to me after I listened to Unleash the Ar Archers. So I don't know if it was because the gallopy bass thing or if it was just because they're like, hey, if you like that, then you'll also like this. So let's see how October ends, because it does every year. It starts, it ends, and there's a Halloween in there somewhere. So let's see where Halloween is. And I just want to weird. Okay. So I just want to say, don't ever use a noose as a leash. Do you guys hear that? Okay. Sometimes my microphone makes it weird. I apologize for the for the that you just had to deal with. But stop it. So I'm about to punch this microphone. I will. Don't think I want microphone. I will go to resort to violence. I don't want to. But anyway, what I was saying, don't ever use a noose as a leash because nooses are designed to tighten and then not loosen back. Most of the time, a real noose, you have to cut them off. In those mo in the movies where you see them going, ah, 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 and pulling them out, if you had a day, maybe, or if it was tied wrong, Maybe, but no, you got to cut those things because nooses are designed to go whip and then never come back. So don't ever use one as a leash on your pets, on your friends, on your pet friends, on your friends' pets. None of those things. Don't use them on anything that you're not intending to noose for it to be the end of that creature's existence. So with that that's my it for my public service announcement. Let's get, jump back into the playtime before I destroy this microphone with my mind. Keep them up being close to the party. Maybe they'll take a break from hunting me. Give me a minute. Oh, I can't fucking breathe. I only want to be alone, feeling shit in my zone. This existential crisis is my own. I'm not the only to get dragged down by my burden. It is my fault. I'm to blame. Of that I'm certain. <laughs> I'm 
Stop getting it right when I tell you to get it. That's not cool. But no, that was good. That was good. Uh, you know, a little bit too processed for my taste, but, you know, that's, you know, it's a modern song, so I understand. Um, one of the things that, um, oh, what's that dude's name? Rick Beato, 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 yeah, Rick Beato. Um, he had a really interesting take on one of the reasons why new music and old music sound so different, and it's because of the dynamics. Um, with everything being digital, you don't really have an opportunity to to put any minute differences in between the notes that occur naturally if you're playing like a, a analog instrument, you know, an, an, a, nat a, you know an, a naturally aspirated <laughs> instrument. Um, and so you don't get those, those tiny variations and those, those small differences. And so it always sounds the same. And you'd think, oh, that's good and some people really like that and other people really don't and it's a it's an interesting difference in the music between now and then is even guitars and basses and you know drums and things like that are so processed that it eliminates a lot of those subtle differences and uh you know because you're not really hearing any of the normal acoustic tone you're not hearing the the natural tone of the instrument there's no no part of that that's the clean channel you know it's all sent through the processor and comes out the other side so yeah just just uh an insight that he came up with that i really you know the more i listen to music and the more i see it yeah and maybe that's what the deal is maybe you know i'm missing those nuances in the modern music that that we had in abundance in the old stuff so i don't know it was good i liked it um a little bit samey you know on the metal band side metal band's been doing that that breakdown you know, since there have been metal bands so you know Guys, go out there. Break new ground. Do it. Find some. Break it. And until then, I'm going to sit here on my butt and wait. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for joining me. One of these days, I won't be stupid or crazy. And, you know, or not. And I will talk to you later. Or at you, to you, with you. Someday, maybe. Anyway, have a wonderful day. Peace.